All right. Good morning, evening, or afternoon, whenever you're watching this. Um, came out yesterday, I believe, that Isaiah Thomas is looking at making an NBA comeback. Um, I don't really know if I can call it a comeback. Him having played last year for the Wizards in about 40 games. I guess you can call it a comeback because he hasn't really been his, his old self in about three years. Um, he last looked really good in a Celtics uniform, but that kind of fell apart when he got injured, uh, being traded to the Cleveland Cavaliers in the uh, Kyrie Irving trade, but then he played forever. He played last year for the Washington Wizards. He averaged 12.2 points in three point, and 3.7 assists in about 40 games before we before being traded to the Clippers for Marcus Morris and was quickly waived, was mostly traded there for salary cap issues. He's 31. He'll probably get picked up. There's always a team who has guards who needs, you know, more guards. Uh, had surgery, had knee surgery this this year, successfully did that. His end of his career was a... Uh, his career kind of, kind of came to a short, and he really deserves a second chance. Uh, became a bit of a journeyman late in his career. Uh, being drafted by the Sacramento Kings in the last pick. Bounced to the Phoenix Suns. Became a piece of a third, a platoon, three-quarter, three-quarterback, three-point guard system. Went to the Boston Celtics and really picked it up there. Uh, went from Boston to Cleveland. To Cleveland to, I believe, Utah. To Utah to Denver. Spent some time with the Lakers in there. Just really bounced around a lot, which is sad because he's a former, you know, All NBA player, two time All Star. I think he will get picked up. Just for a simple fact that someone's going to say, "Well, if we can, if he's mobile now, and can play at a high level again, uh, could he go back to the All Star form?" Now I know his All Star form was 2015, 2016, and 2016, 2017 when he was a two time All Star. That's essentially five or six years ago now, but when he was there in 2016, he finished you know fifth in All Star voting, or sorry, in MVP voting. Um, if he can get back to that, maybe he plays a different style because he's not going to try to get injured, or maybe it ruins his career. Maybe he plays more cautious. Um, I don't know how I feel about this. I think he will get picked up. Someone will give him a chance, although it might have to, he might have to sign like a one year deal, like a prove it deal. Much like that, Derek Rose, Derek Rose had to sign with the Cleveland Cavaliers. I think he will get picked up. I think it's a matter of a team looking at going. We need guard help. Maybe they sign him on a veteran minimum. Um, now Derek Rose is picked up a lot because he's a former MVP. If he can be even half the player he was in the NBA season, he's a lot better guard than a lot of players in the league. I think Isaiah will get picked up. I'm not 100 percent sure where. Maybe he goes back to Sacramento. Because they're having issues right now with Buddy Hield. Maybe he goes back to Boston. Maybe he becomes a deaf piece. I don't think he's a starter at this point in his career. I think for his longevity and his knees, he needs to come off the bench. Just so he can, you know, play more minutes and be more useful and have a longer career if he comes off the bench. Um, he might have to prove himself in the G League. First team might end up having to go to China. Just because... Of the injury history, and I don't know if an NBA team will take a chance on him out of the gate. Um, let me know what you think down below. I'd love to hear about it. Um, make sure to hit like and subscribe. Share this video as much as you like. But uh, Isaiah Thomas is looking to make a comeback. Uh, can he? Uh, he'll probably get a chance at the NBA. I'm sure some team will give him, will sign him. Some team will be in trouble this year. Or have a free agent issue, or he'll play in the J League. He might go to a team rebuilding, thinking they're a piece away. And he might be used as a veteran. He might be used as a veteran presence. Maybe for a young team who isn't taking it seriously. They'll go look to self as your career can change. I've been there. I'm 31. Uh, like I said, he's only 31. 31 isn't old by no means. But if you got a bum knee, it might be a little harder for him to get a job. Uh, anyway, you all have a great Tuesday. Um, like I said, hit like and subscribe if you're browsing your way through and it's happened upon this video. You all have a great day. Bye.